about today's video because for the first time ever in my life I went to a Bath and Body Works. Very recently Bath and Body Works opened up a few stores in Australia which has just made my little heart so happy and I finally had the chance to go out and visit one because I don't live really close to one so it was a little bit of a journey. So I stepped foot in a Bath and Body Works for the first time and it was magical. I can't believe I have Bath and Body Works shopping bags even when they handed me these I was like oh Gosh, I feel so cool right now. I spent so long in that store. I made sure that I smelled every candle and I was just in my element. It was everything I thought it would be and more. You guys, I am not joking. I, oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, these are so heavy and they're just filled with amazing things. So I think it's time that we dive in and let's see what I picked up. Ah! The first candle, of course, that I gravitated towards was this beautiful pink one. And not only is it an amazing smelling candle, but the actual packaging of this candle is very aesthetically pleasing. It's very pretty. This one is Palo Santo. That's probably not at all how you say it, but this is one of their three wick candles. And oh my gosh, this smells heavenly. You guys are going to soon realize I'm very weird at describing scents. And this candle to me... Smells like a very attractive man mixed with Christmas spices. This next one I'm pretty sure is from the same range and this is white opal and again it has this really pretty geometric gold print on it and I can't even remember what these smell like so this is very exciting for me. Oh I'm getting major rosemary vibes. So the first thing I thought of when I smelled this was the herb rosemary which I love the smell of but it's also sweet so it doesn't smell like straight up rosemary which is great. It's got like a hint of sweetness and just amazingness. When I was walking around and smelling all the candles, there was a candle sitting on top of this little stand and I've never seen anything like this in Australia. We just put our candles out. We don't put them on stands or anything. So this was really cute. It looks like a little white tree trunk and this really looks nice in my kitchen. You just take your candle and prop it on top and then it looks more like a decor piece, which I love. It makes it more of a feature instead of just a candle on its own. It now has a little home. They also had quite a few of these and I'm not sure what the proper technical name for these are. I'm just going to call them candle clothes, but basically they're just made of metal and you take your little candle clothes and then you take your candle and you pop it inside. And like I said, it just makes it look like more of a decor piece. And I thought this was really cool. These are so interesting. And I'm really hoping that at Christmas time, they'll come out with like some Christmassy themed ones. I'm pretty sure they do that in the United States. So it'd be cool if our Bath and Body Works did that too. And then I could have Christmassy themed candles and they'd be totally dressed for Christmas too. And everyone could just be in the Christmas spirit. These two candles that I picked up, I'm pretty sure are from the same range. And this one is Mahogany Teakwood. And this one is Midnight Blue Citrus, and they both smell like a very attractive man, but in two different ways. <laughs> Mahogany Teak Wood smells like straight up men's cologne, which I love. I love the smell of men's cologne, and I would like to think that Chris Hemsworth would smell like this because it smells really, really good. Midnight Blue Citrus. Again, has that like underlying men's cologne smell, but it's also a little bit sweeter. I feel like it could be more of like a unisex perfume. <laughs> it smells sweet and a little bit fruity, and I've never found a candle that smelled like this, but I'm very much obsessed with it, and my apartment is going to be just smelling amazing, you guys. <laughs> I could not go to Bath & Body Works without picking up a hand sanitizer, and there were so many to choose from, but I went with Dazzling Diamond, basically because it's got really pretty glitter in it, and I love glitter. And then just like the candles having their little outfits and clothes, the little sanitizers have them too. And I picked up this little pink glittery one and I'm pretty sure you just 
put the sanitizer in here and then you can like attach it to your keys, I think. Come on, little hand sanitizer, you gotta wear your sparkly outfit. There we go, I have accessorized my little hand sanitizer and it's got a pretty little glittery cover. Then I wandered over to the hand soap area. Like I said, I was just looking at everything and I found these two foaming hand washes. So this one is watermelon lemonade and this one is a lime and turmeric. I've already used a little bit of lime and turmeric and it smells incredible. It makes you wanna wash your hands just so you can smell this amazing fragrance. And just like the candles and just like the hand sanitizer, these needed an outfit as well and Bath and Body Works just came through. If you think your hand soap needs to be a little bit cuter, you can pick up one of these little cases for it and you just pop your hand soap inside and then it's got a little sparkly outfit on and I just think this is so cute. I loved this idea. Oh my gosh, I picked up so many body products. I picked up three full-size shower gels and I have actually used a Bath and Body Works shower gel before. I bought one online I think like two years ago and I loved it and what I love about the Bath and Body Works shower gels is they lather so well and I find that the scent really lasts on your skin. So I picked up Pink Chiffon and then Paris Amour and then I picked up Sweet Pea because this I feel like it's just such an iconic scent. I wanted to pick up a full size body lotion so I picked up the scent Paris Amour which is the same as this shower gel so I have the matching shower gel and body lotion so I can use these together. Another candle I picked up is Gold Digger and this one smells really nice. It's got a nice light fragrance. This one is very spicy and very cozy and it's also a nice light fragrance. It's not too strong which is great because strong fragrances give me a headache and they really hurt my throat so I like nice subtle smelling candles that's everything that I picked up from Bath and Body Works if there's anything that you think I need to check out from Bath and Body Works please let me know if there's a particular scent that you think I would love please let me know because I would love to check it out I was very overwhelmed when I walked in there there was just so much for me to take in so I would love your recommendations if you haven't subscribed don't forget to click the red subscribe button before before you leave so you'll never miss another video thank you for watching i love you to the moon and back and i will see you all in my next video bye okay.